Hey guys, now I'm Will Sars coming at you with another quick video. Uh, video I'm doing today is going to be a little bit different than my normal videos. I'm not here reviewing any guns or looking at any guns or holsters or anything like that. I'm actually doing a kind of a transformation project of a truck that I recently picked up. I had a little Toyota Tacoma that I put a lot of money into and uh, my son playing around in the background and uh, did a lot of stuff to it but never did do any video or pictures or anything like that and uh, it's something I kind of like doing um, just like with my Glocks I like kind of personalizing them and uh, setting them up the way I like them so I figured this time around since I did all the work to the Tacoma and got rid of it, I decided I'd do a little something with the F-150 here that I picked up and uh, kind of tell you guys about it and show you kind of what I've done to this thing and uh, what I'm going to do here in the next few days. So uh, let's see what we can do here for you. All right, here's the truck. This is a 2017 f-150 xlt four-wheel drive and uh it basically came as you see it aside from the rims and tires and the nerf bars on the side but this is a four-wheel drive this is the eco boost edition with the 3.5 liter v6 eco boost and uh so far what i've done with this thing it uh, i've changed out the rims and tires it came with a kind of cheap set of uh, hubcaps with uh, rims with a set of like hubcap skins or something I don't know what the heck they were they were black they didn't look too bad and just a stock set of Mesa tires and uh, I've upgraded now to a set of 285 70 17 uh, Terra grapplers these are Nitto tires and a uh, set of American Outlaw Lone Star rims uh, so, so far I've done that, and this afternoon I put on a set of side steps or Nerf bars uh, here. Don't even remember what brand they are, just kind of found them on Amazon. They were cheapies. Uh, wanted something so that the wifey didn't complain anymore about having to jump up into the truck to get in. So, so far we've done that, and I put a two-inch leveling kit on this thing. Um, I mean, it, it was okay before, but kind of wanted to level it out and I think it makes it look a whole lot better with that two inch uh, leveling kit I think this is a rough country just little spacers inside there nothing extravagant uh, oh yeah and yesterday I went and had the windows tinted I did the front strip here on the wind front window and I had the uh, side windows done to match the rears um, and of course as I do on all my trucks. I went ahead and put a few stickers on the back. Kinda like stickers, I don't know why. But uh, went around yesterday, cleaned it up, washed it, and uh, used some back to black on the black plastic parts to kinda bring a little shine to it. You know, these things get faded. So I like to use the back to black to go ahead kind of restore that but right now that's pretty much what I've done I'm gonna go ahead and put some uh, vent visors up here on the windows the black uh, or smoke uh, vent visors and I've got myself a new grill coming tomorrow I'm gonna go ahead and put a Raptor, Raptor style grill on this thing and see how that looks but uh, right now that's what I've done so far I just wanted to bring that to you show it to you um i like trucks i know there's a lot of folks that like trucks and cars and motorcycles and everything else but i kind of enjoy taking a truck and kind of putting my stamp on it and kind of putting it together the way i like it so i figured i'd bring that to you and show you i'll bring you some more videos here in the future as i continue to uh do more work to this thing but this is the 2017 f-150 xlt 3.5 liter EcoBoost four wheel.